I just did this fucking creek crossing yesterday. I voiced over but excited because I found a fucking crow's egg. A crow's egg, I think anyway. Look how bloody blue it is. And then found more crunched up on the ground and looked up and there was a nest. Very cool. Digging the ground, this is a buried steel post. People thought it was a log, but it's definitely not. Um, it was still attached to bloody wire, so that's why it was so fucking hard to get out of the ground. I was taking my shoes off on and off all day because of the water and then because of the hot sand. And, oh, 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 back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. Mushrooms. What have you guessed it? Putting the shoes back on. Finally got the creek crossing up. As I was sweating my ring off, I had a big old glug glug of water. This is Coach. He's a good boy. Then I had a mango. Oh, I had lunch and I had a cheeky nap. And then this is Puppy and Coach. And then Coach and a mango seed. Very cute. Going down a creek bank. How's the serenity? Taking my shoes back off again. Sand. Walking through the water. R.I.P. Mr. Krabs. And would you believe it? Guess where the fence was? In a fucking tree. If I'm being very honest, one of my favourite things is climbing, so it wasn't that bad. Should have been using pliers though, as you can see. I just sliced my finger open. Very nice. Very nice. Now, if you're thinking about swiping, don't, because the next part, guess what? There's going to be more fencing. There's going to be more barbed wire in sand. Throw on a shtick for the dogs. That is a fucking mess. Yucky, yucky, yuck. I need a big boy. Give me a big... That fence was doing acrobatics in the water. I had to twist it that many times. Got it up, drive home. I sat and watched the storm. Nearly home, saw a frog. Lightning, but no rain.